Herbert hops in and breaks the count, and Lawler has a little sadistic smile. You think he's worried? He wants some of him, Danny. He does, but Lawler's stalking him now. He's about to make his move. Unless Gilbert decides to run out of the ring again and argue with the ref. He's doing everything he can to avoid contact. There they tie it up. Big right hand from Gilbert, and Lawler goes to his tights, and once again, Gilbert hits the floor and runs around the ring. Now he's threatening referee Jerry Calhoun if you don't do something. Obviously, Gilbert does not want the one-on-one -on -one meeting with Lawler that he had said, I'm begging for that opportunity. I don't think so. Neither do I. And also remember, Lance, there's other Gilberts in the building. Oh. So Jerry's got more on his mind than just Eddie, I'm sure. Very good point. And as the crowd helps the referee at the count of seven, Eddie jumps back underneath the bottom rope and breaks it. He has a 10 count. He's now back in the ramp. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, he said. Yeah, a long time. And here's Gilbert again. Eddie Gilbert, once again, pleading with the referee to check him out. And the referee says, if you want to take the 10 count, go. Count of two, three. was the nine count. He almost got him that time, Danny. Hey, one or two more seconds and it would have been a count out and the win would have went to Lawler. You know, I really don't think that's what Jerry Lawler wants, though. No, I, not at all. What he, he wants, wants is right some now. of his frame. That's what he wants. Yeah, you can still see the scars on him. And he's not soon going to forget that, Lance. And he sure doesn't want a count out. Eddie Gilbert what his complaint is now. Anything to stay away. They tie up now. Collar and elbow. Goes back into the tights again and Gilbert ducks. And heads for the concrete. Woo. Missy Hyatt over ministering to her poor fallen warrior. Hot stuff is down on the deck and he doesn't look so hot right at the moment. You made a good point a moment ago though, Danny, about other Gilberts in the building. Tommy, his father, and Doug, his brother, they're around. Well, I wouldn't be surprised to see him. Jerry Lawler knows they're in the building, and it's got to play some part in his mind. But I'll tell you right now, Missy Hyatt's not having a good time with the crowd here. She's about to cry. We are right now into the action of the King, Jerry Lawler, and hot stuff, Eddie Gilbert. score match of the week. And boy, what a selection it is. The Lawler-Gilbert confrontation. Gilbert drives a knee and Lawler hits the deck. Now, Eddie is over there messing around trying to get a rope loose that he can choke Lawler with on the top turnbuckle pad. Yeah, we can see just the corner of it. He's taking it off. He's got about half of he's it off right it. now, and now he's got the rope. Choking yeah. Lawler. And you remember, the ref cannot do anything right now. Lawler being strangled by Eddie Gilbert. As Gilbert now covers Lawler after the rope comes off his throat, and Jerry on a one-two kicks out of it. Lawler kicked his way loose at the two count, but Gilbert's right back with that rope around his neck. And Lawler down on the deck, his feet up on the ring ropes, but Gilbert with a knee toward the back is pulling up on that rope trying to choke him. Let's it loose. They go for the pinfall now. Count of two. And Missy pushes Lawler's foot off the rope. The referee tells her, get away from the ringside. Keep your hands off from inside. Oh, boy. Oh, no. mm. Gilbert hit him 
with a literal clothesline. He pulled the rope apart and stabbed Lawler right in the throat with it. The King down on the deck. As Gilbert choking him again, Lawler is going to have to muster that great comeback power of his to see if he can avoid being defeated by Gilbert again. I'll tell you, if Lawler gets hold of that rope, he wouldn't hesitate to use it back on Gilbert. I'll tell you really? that right now. Well, you're absolutely right now. Oh. Gilbert looks like he's tying him to the rope. Tying him to the rope, yeah. that's right. Top rope, Gilbert knots it around Lawler's neck, around the turnbuckle rope. Pulls it down to tighten it up in a square knot. And hoping to have Lawler immobilized in that corner. He's tying in as many knots as he can right now. I mean, that's it. Lawler. Seen him in too many tough situations to count him out at this point. No one mounts a better comeback than Jerry Lawler. He's seen it, Lance, for many years. And I have a feeling we're about to see it when he gets out. trying to work that. He got one loop a loop around. He got another one, and it's finally loose, but loose Gilbert down. the rope. Look at the look on Lawler's face. He's not through with them yet, I'll tell you that. Gilbert's begging for no more. Lawler going for the pile driver. Remember, it's a no disqualification match, so he Mrs. Gilbert and Eddie signaling to Missy. I don't know what he's telling her to do. I don't know either, but she is saying, what do you want? What do you want? Give me your shoe. That's what she's saying. Off oh, Jerry Bryant comes over, grabs the hand and the shoe, and now Bryant's got it, and Missy is one shoe left. One shoe left.